how to give access to your team, to an employee. I always recommend give somebody access to your account, even if it's your husband, your sister, your brother, your daughter. It needs to be somebody because it's very likely you will get locked out of your account at some stage and dealing with Facebook on the back end is not an easy task. It's a backup plan so you don't lose everything. We're in business.facebook.com forward slash setting. We're going to come over to the hamburger menu if you can find your way, business settings. We're going to click users and people. In the previous videos, we connected our pixel, we created our ad account, we added our pages. But how on earth do we give permission? Just adding somebody does not give them permission to manage what Facebook called assets. In order for somebody to manage the pixel, the ad account, the pages, all need to be done in here. If I click on myself, Let's click on assign assets and then we'll select all. We'll go through everything here. This is me, so revenue is fine. Classic pages. There's nobody here to be found. Ad account. Give permission to the ad account. Catalogs have nothing there. Apps have nothing there. Pixels, yes. Where's my pixel? Ooh. Oh, sorry, it's data sets now. So if you already have a pixel before data sets, so in the earlier video, we created data sets because pixel. Are getting phased out and again I want to give myself hit save changes and now I have permission to manage everything the Instagram account would have been there if that was connected now this is the other part of it what do you do if you want to give your employee access or you're working with a contractor or freelancer we're going to invite our people and let's do and no and so we're going to tick next what type of access do we want to give them do we want to give them partial access few people with full control everyone added to the business portfolio gets basic access they can only work on pages instagram accounts or other business assets that are assigned to them apps and integrations if you want them to manage the conversions api monitor events and create access tokens and full control this is the most control that somebody can have they can do all of the above, assign other people full control and manage and delete the business portfolio. And let's do the advanced. So the advanced options I tend to use if you have an accountant or somebody needs to be looking at the finance details or you have a manager, somebody else who wants to be looking at the finance. So let's say we just gave them basic. This is the easiest way so you can visually see it. So you can literally toggle on. Now where a lot of errors happen is people don't toggle on everything. I hear all the time, oh, I gave you access to my ad account. The person cannot see the ad account. And this tends to be where it's from. Sometimes even if you click the full access, you amend everything in here. So you select, okay, we've got the person, the, we're going to select the ad account. We're going to give them what access, manage ad account. If somebody is managing your ad account, they're going to need man manage access, pixel. If you've got an older account, your pixel will be here and you will do exactly the same thing. Same with pages here. You will see Instagram also what you want them to see. I'm going to do this as my backup. So let's get everything. If you create any new pieces of information, you're going to need to come in here. Let's do the invite. Invitation has been sent. This person has been sent an invitation to join as an employee. You can also give them access to three accounts or two. All right. So there is the person here. Now it does say basic access. So even here we come over, assign the assets. You can see here that that has not come through exactly how we would like it. And then you just go through and update there. So assigning assets is the number one place where people fall down and trying to give access to pixel, the ad account and the pages. So this is your saving grace. Come in, find the person, assign assets hit save should make all the difference that you need to do there. This is what your assigned assets should look like. So if you've got multiple people here and there's nothing showing here, simply just follow the steps again. The system can't be weird. Now, after the fact, I have added on my Instagram account. So right now I do not have permission for it. So I'm going to assign assets. I'm going to come over here. I'm going to go to Instagram account. It's it's grayed out here. There's a warning. So I'm just going to log into the account. Here we go. Select all. 
toggle on every single thing. Save changes. Asset has been added and there we go. 